Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Dan Joseph. And I'm Laura Cavanaugh. Our top story tonight. Method Mayor Gary Wheeler sidelined from city business after suffering a heart attack this weekend. Tonight, what's in store for the mayor and for the city? Medford Mayor Gary Wheeler taking a break from his traditional mayoral duties after suffering a coronary episode on Saturday. Sometimes we have these little wake-up calls and it says uh, time to change lifestyle a little bit. The wake-up call, a heart attack late Saturday night that sent Wheeler to Rogue Regional Medical Center for immediate surgery. It was not a typical heart attack and I may have had a couple of silent ones that I wasn't aware of, but they said it was really uh, a severe one, uh, but I got there you know, in time. Wheeler says at first he had dismissed the symptoms as indigestion. We had dinner early that night, and uh, but it just felt like a little pressure in the chest. Then it started to radiate into the back, and you know you take a little uh, uh, Alka-Seltzer or whatever an antacid to sort of see if that will help in it, and, uh, and it really didn't. But it was his wife, Treasure, who urged him to head straight to the hospital. It was there he underwent immediate surgery, having two stents put in. Deputy City Manager Bill Hoke says everyone in the mayor's office was initially concerned. Anytime someone has something that affects their heart, uh, you need to worry. Uh, you, you don't take it lightly. But confident that the mayor was in good hands at Rogue Regional Medical Center's cardiac care unit. The best care in the United States for cardiac care is in this valley. So I felt more comfortable that he would be cared for appropriately. And he was. On Tuesday, Wheeler was released from the hospital. He is reportedly up and walking and well on his road to recovery. I, I feel very good. His prescription, a few lifestyle changes. I'm now going to be on a, you know, on the diet. On the uh, low fat, low, low cholesterol. And the mayor says he will be resting at home this week, but Wheeler does not anticipate any hiccups in the system. In the mayor's absence, Council President Al Densmore will take the reins and run the city council meetings. We're going to keep doing people's business. This is a well-oiled machine. We're fortunate enough to have a good, solid community, a uh, good, solid leadership, and some very strong department heads, and, and we have uh, succession plans. The mayor, who is also a local optometrist, shows no signs of slowing down. And by speaking to NBC5, Mayor Wheeler says he hopes that it will alert his constituents to be vigilant about their health. To other people that are having, you know, they get these little little symptoms and stuff to not, not put it off. Don't ignore what your body tells you. Well, Mayor Wheeler says he should be back doing city business within the next two weeks. Meanwhile, the next city council meeting is scheduled for this Thursday.